happy Mother's Day, y'all. Today is a day that you 100% have to let mom choose the lunch place after church at a bare minimum. And if you've not bought her flowers yet, then, well, I hate to break it to you. The ones that we are handing out to her after the service do not count for you. All right. Hey, speaking of counting, many of you know that our church's 50th anniversary is coming up really soon. More on that next couple weeks. But we recently recorded our 50th podcast episode of Thursday's Roundtable with Pastor Wes, Matt, and myself. So be sure to check it out and give it a listen. Hey, church family, I just want to make sure you know that May 28 is a big day for our church. That is the day we recognize our graduating seniors. That's right. It's Senior Recognition Sunday, so make sure you are here on that very special day. Also, for those of you that have given to Guatemala, thank you so much. Many of you have donated shoes, money. Just so you know, this Wednesday is the last day to donate those shoes. Bring by the office or bring them Wednesday night. Um, thank you so much for your support. It means the world to us. 20 days. 20 days till sports camp. We are so excited that God has given us this opportunity to reach into our community to introduce kids to Jesus Christ. Thank you for all that have volunteered. We have so much going on. The next couple of weeks getting ready for camp. We ask that you pray for us, invite your friends, kids, tell your friends to sign up. We would love to have them. We're looking forward to a great week. <laughs> what makes your mom happy? Flowers, when I listen, when I be good or something, a hug. I don't know, that's too tight. What makes your mom sad? When I don't listen, oh, I go and get hurt. What's something that your mom does every day? Read the Bible, cleans the house, I think work. Kisses me. What's something your mom always says to you? I love you. I'm trying to eat. Go clean your room. Behave. Don't let the dog upstairs. Do not bother mom when while she's sleeping. How old is your mom? I think five. Twelve. That's a very, very tricky question. Um, I know she's um, a half and something. Seventy. What's your mom's favorite thing to do? Play with me. Sit in that chair. Date night. Shop. Shopping. Go shopping. She's just shopping every day. She just always wants to go shopping. She and I get tired. Doing that, it's kind of boring. Where's your mom's favorite place to go? Chinese restaurant. An animal shop too? I think it's to the mall. <laughs> go to the restroom. <laughs> How are you and your mom the same? Our hair. Our eyes. We'll have the same phones. We're really flexible. We both have long tongues, but my sister and my dad don't really. How are you and your mom different? Our eyes are different. The color of me. I'm brown and she's tan. Mom has curly hair and I have straight hair. I do have better abs. What's your favorite thing about your mom? That she doesn't like to be away from us. When she gets down the floor and plays with me. She's a really good teacher. I like her face. Her smile. When she lets me put on her makeup. That I can cuddle with her <laughs> at night. She is really special. She's really, 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 really nice. How do you know that your mom loves you? She prays and she kisses me and she says I love you. Because she's in my family. How she takes care of us. By making breakfast. Do my laundry. That she helps me get dressed. Takes me to all the things I do after school. That she plays games with me. Play soccer with me. Play bubbles. When I sit in her lap. We watch movies. We get our nails painted. Make a scrapbook. Fish. Fish. Outside cookouts and bonfires. She spends time with us and not all by herself. She's patient. With us. She does everything with me. Because she says it every day. Kisses me every night. And all kinds of stuff. I just know that she loves me because she says, I'll always love you. She's awesome. She loves me no matter what. Like God. I love you, Mommy. Happy Mother's Day. <laughs>